Just got back from dance. Capria did so good. She cried. She walked in fine with the teacher and then sat down by her number and then just started bawling her eyes out. So the other teacher came and Capria sat on her lap and she was still crying a little bit but then after like three minutes she stopped crying and didn't cry the entire rest of the dance class. And she did all the movements, stuff she wouldn't do when I was in there. Like she did everything, everything. Usually she just like stands there and watches them, but today she fully participated. I just feel so much better because I was getting worried, like especially with the baby coming and how attached Capria is to me. I just was so worried that dance would like make it worse like if she didn't like it and had to go all the time like I almost like was gonna take her out of it if it was like that bad as bad as it was last week every week I would have probably taken her out but today she loved it she was interacting with the other girls and it just takes a huge weight off my shoulders but anyways we are home now I am getting my makeup on for the day now because we woke up late and had to rush Nico off to school and then rush off to dance so I didn't have time to get myself ready so I'm just putting on like a little bit of makeup very quickly um Capri is in living room watching Mickey as usual when I tell you, she is obsessed with Mickey. Absolutely obsessed. Like, she'll do this all day if I let her. But yeah, at least that's keeping her occupied while I do my makeup real quick. I was going to run a ton of errands today because I have a lot of returns. I have pickup orders to pick up um, with baby clothes because I have this huge box of baby clothes that I just went through over the weekend for the baby and I'm not even done with it yet. But the stuff, like, okay, it's all Nico's clothes from 2020, okay? Style was a lot different back then, and things we thought were cute then are maybe not so cute now. So, Polly doesn't understand that, obviously, but I wanted to get some stuff that was, like, super cute. Like, so when people come over to see him, his going home outfit I wanted to get new, um, Thanksgiving outfit, you know, stuff like that. Um, so I did order, we had a good sale at Kohl's and I had a gift card actually. So I did order a few outfits, three outfits actually, from there and they're three, three piece outfits. So it was, I got a pretty good deal on those. So I have to pick those up. Um, I might, might pick them up after I pick Nico up from school and take both kids with me. Um, because I just have to pick those up and return some Amazon things at Kohl's. So, and I want to do that, like, ASAP. And since we had dance this morning, I didn't want to be out of the house all day because I have stuff to do before Nico comes home. So, um, I figured I would do it tomorrow, but I might try to do it today after I pick up Nico. We'll see. We'll see how he is because... Oh, he's been a handful lately, but anyways, I'm going to get my makeup done and then we're going to take a nap or Capria's going to take a nap. I will probably lay down for a few minutes because I'm exhausted as usual, but then I don't really know what I'm going to do. Um, there's a few things I have to get done around the house, but we'll see what happens. Today is kind of like, ever since we woke up late, Nothing has gone the way it was supposed to, as is expected when you wake up late and have to rush out the door. 
So I'm just gonna see what I get done and just go from there. But welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe. Let me know if you like this video by giving it a thumbs up so I know that you like it. And yeah, welcome to another day. She's still just like perfectly fine sitting here watching Mickey. She could literally do this all day. Right? No, 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 no. Right, take a nappy? No, 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 no. It's night time. I'm night not. Time. You're not? It's night night time. I'm not. Oh, excuse <laughs> me. Let's go read your bookie. Okay? I'm not. And then we can watch Mickey after. Okay? He's not doing anything. Oh, what? He's not doing anything. He's by the gate. Oh my no. goodness. You're so touchy today. Okay, let's go read it. Come on. Come on, let's go. Ah! Here, Rocco can come down here and we're going to go read. No, me. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Ah! Priya. Excuse me. No, no. Mommy? I got it. Got it. Wait, the upstairs first. Dee, 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 dee. Hey, I do. Yeah. Hey, I do. Yeah, come on. Hey. Hey. I got many. I literally fell asleep for Capria's entire nap with her. Literally just woke up and not happy about it. I guess I, I guess I needed the sleep though. So, I mean, what are you gonna do? But um, now we have to go pick up Nico. So, we're going to get them now. Um, I want to stop at Kohl's and take those things back. And then I also have to pick up a pickup order. But now my stomach hurts and I might have to go right back home when I get him. After I get him. So this day is just not going my way. Besides Capri's dance class, thank God that was a success. And now she says she likes dance, where before she said she didn't like it. So, um, other than that, things have just not gone as planned, but I guess that's being eight months pregnant. I mean, oh, I got a call from the OB and they said that my iron is very low and I need to take iron, an iron supplement basically, which is fine. That's the same thing I had to do with Nico when I was pregnant with Nico, but, um, but yeah, so things are just not going great right now today, I guess, but you know what? I'm gonna maybe just take a day to rest and not do as much, which is so hard for me. I know it's like so normal for everybody else, like, yeah, you're pregnant, you have to rest, like, 
and what do you expect? But I have two kids and I'm trying to stay on track with my house. And once I get even a little bit behind, it like throws me all off track. And it, I think because my ADHD it just makes things more difficult. But I just realized that by this time my postpartum starts with my pregnancies. Like my first pregnancy was postpartum anxiety. That started at seven months and then my postpartum my ADHD got like very, very bad um, when I was like eight months pregnant with Capria. But I feel great actually this time. So hopefully that won't happen. Hopefully I won't have any mental health issues this time around. But anyways, my stomach hurts. Um, on my way to get Nico. Capria hurts too apparently, she just said. And yeah. We'll see what happens after I pick him up. I don't know. Okay, so we are home from picking up Nico. Nico was actually painting last night, and I just realized that there's orange paint on the playroom floor, and it's like from those paint pens, so it doesn't really dry. It stays like tacky. So it's, we've been stepping in it, or somebody has, and it's been being tracked throughout the house. So I'm gonna um, clean the floor real quick because I don't want that to continue. So I'm gonna do that um, after giving them a little snack to sit and eat while they watch TV. And then we're gonna move on to something else. I'll show you what. First I have to clean this. By the way, this is all the clothes that I still have to go through for the baby. Like look at this gigantic box of clothes. This is like what I'm donating and then these are like three to six months and these right here are I think these are big boy clothes like 12 to 18 months and then those are newborn or these are like six to 18 months and then these are newborn down here. So I ran out of totes. I got to get some more but yeah I just there's so much. <laughs> so so much but yeah this is the paint mm -hmm. so yeah we gotta get rid of that hey, <laughs> you guys want a snack first what do you want to eat hungry do you want some yogurt yes yogurt Strawberry. <laughs> no? They're both the same. What is hers? You want blueberry? Okay. Priya, which one do you have? Strawberry? Okay. Okay. I must be coming new with apologies. Holding back, I got history. So Nico has been begging to do an experiment and finally I figured out something that was easy to do, Halloween themed, and it's part of our fun bin. So I told him we could do it after school today. Oh, out of breath. Um, so I have everything in this bin that we need and I'm going to show him how to do it and hopefully it goes well because I haven't done it yet myself but let's just see okay so let me just get don't touch anything I'm just looking <laughs> like they lose little like, potion stuff oh cauldrons the cauldrons take those out yes. mm -hmm. and then is it going to make something 
Yep, and put the cauldrons right into the blue bin. What blue bin? The cauldron. This. I didn't know that was like. I thought that was this full. Because it looked like. Alright, so you're going to take a scoop. Okay. I'll get it of this and put it in a cauldron. Cauldron? Whatever. I'll do this one first. Green? Just do like two drops. Let me see. Two drops? Mm hmm. And each one of them? No, just however many. Is this like a special kind? Is it a special kind? Hmm? Not really. All right, ready? Mm -hmm. Pour it into the cauldron. Squirt it in there. So this experiment is awesome because they can just continue to make it bubble and add different things and it's just different every time. So absolute 10 out of 10 for this experiment. I'm going to make a TikTok video or a shorts video. Um, with everything you need and how I did it. So make sure you look out for that. But super easy and perfect for four-year-olds. So while Nico's doing that, I really need to clean up the kitchen, do the dishes real quick. Um, Capria is watching Mickey. It was the only way I could get her to not mess up the experiment. So, um, she's in here watching Mickey. Per A baby, a dog, one Okay? A baby, a dog, one Okay, you just kind of stay it. Okay? Okay. Oh, now I'm going to stretch. She always talks to her mini and says something to her mini and then she'll be like, okay. But she's singing Rock a Rock a Bye Baby on the treetop, which I didn't even know she knew. And she's singing it to her baby. She kills me. Alright, yeah, so I'm gonna do that and then I have to get dinner started. Cut it bite, but somehow you make me 
same old thoughts be my memory. Be alright, never could. Okay, so I got the kitchen and the dishes done. Um, and I, while I was doing that, I made the mistake of trusting Nico for too long at the dining room table with his experiment. And he ended up getting food coloring everywhere, including all over the floor I just washed and my white chairs. So just got that all cleaned up as well otherwise the experiment was really not that much of a cleanup it was not that bad because it was all contained should have been contained to that one bin and so everything pretty much just got dumped in the garbage nico also got food coloring all over his hands and he can't get it off and he does not like that so i'm actually gonna do a bath before dinner tonight um so i'll do that now make dinner and then Polly should be home just in time to eat. And then shortly after that will be bedtime. So I'm going to end it here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It definitely was not a productive day. But we got some stuff done. Nico got to do his experiment that he's been waiting for. So I'm happy about that. He really enjoyed it. So I'm happy about that. But yeah, um, you know, some days are just not going to go as planned. Especially when you're eight months pregnant. And exhausted so um, we did the best we can and I hope you guys enjoyed it so thank you guys as always for watching if you're not subscribed make sure you subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it so I know that you like it and I'll see you in the next one bye bye Mama.